What is up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. Um, I just finished recording a video for you guys regarding the new giveaway details. I did it out of my phone so it could be instant. Um, today, we are going to be pulling the engine out of this Civic. I'm going to go ahead and set this up at top dead center before I pull anything out. And then I'm going to go ahead and just yank it out. And I am going to do the same thing for Nesquik. Um, if you watch my other video, so basically we're going to be giving away the shell instead of doing the cash giveaway. Um, I do have a clean Illinois title for this car. Um, yeah, so this is what we're going to be giving away. I am going to be pulling the engine out. The only thing I'm giving away is the shell. It will come with the lowering suspension that was in this car. I still got to pull the suspension out of the front, but I will do so when I pull the engine out. And I will do the same with this one. It will come with the front bumper for Nesquik. And the rules are very simple. You guys already know how I do my raffles. Um, you just got to follow the same instructions. And we are going to do a week. So if you haven't picked this car up in a week, then we are going to raffle it off to the next person. We are going to make sure that it is one week because I'm going to be recording when this car leaves my garage. I'm going to need this car out of here so I can really start working on this one. I need all the space in this garage as possible. I've owned this car for about three years, I believe, something like that. Maybe a little bit longer. And I've been modifying it little by little. And like I always said, that I was building this for my YouTube channel, that this car pretty much belonged to you guys, that I was building it for you guys. So I guess now it's time for you guys to take it, take the Civic. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw you guys on a time lapse and we're gonna go ahead and start pulling this engine. Oh, before I forget, check this out. You guys see this? I got new lights. So now when I got the garage door, you can really see in here really clear. So I could probably work at nighttime if I needed to. But either way, I'm gonna go ahead and throw you guys on a time lapse.
I'm gonna go ahead and call it a day here. Um, we did get pretty far. I'm gonna take a small little break. The exhaust is ready to come off. It's disconnected from here on back. The only thing holding it are the hangers all the way through the back. Um, we gotta drain the oil for the transmission. We gotta drain the oil for, for the engine oil. We'll do that tomorrow. We got all of this is connected completely all the way around the back. We got our fuel disconnected you guys seen that I got this engine at top dead center that's what I did at the beginning I went ahead and I made sure that it was a top dead center and the lines down here were the timing marks were up correctly facing directly lined up with the mark we are almost ready to drop this engine um, we do have to disconnect the shift linkage to the transmission which is gonna be a pain to take off but I'm gonna have to do it um, and then we got to take the power steering stuff off and drain the fluid and then after that we could go ahead and drop our engine down so with that being said this is going to be the end of it I'll catch you guys possibly tomorrow or the day after but peace out stay safe catch you guys later
like me. 